very important for us to be heard uh, at this matter. Thanks, so many thanks to the students of Ernst Busch that did all the organization of this event. Uh, thanks a lot to Basil Senegal and of course to Anna Kies, the director of Ernst Busch, supported to us and gave us space today to be heard about it. Um, the whole communication started from the National Theatre Drama School of Greece, which is the school that started the um, squads, the occupations of the whole what's going on right now in Greece. Uh, I personally thank you and we all Greeks from that are, are right now on streets in occupied uh, buildings strugg struggling for things that in other countries are given. Meanwhile, we are here since Greek media cover the story selectively, let's say. There is not real update by the news, the TV, the newspapers for what going on in Greece right now in between the country. So we use the public space of a foreign country so that we will be able to be heard in our own country and also abroad. Please spread the word. First things first, we are here today after the last presidential degree, which is the above. education and performing arts are undergrounding. The degree defends that a performing arts degree, which normally corresponds to a bachelor degree of fine arts, has now been downgraded into the compatibility of a high school diploma. Performing arts studies, such as theater, music, dance, etc., are all affected. Given the fact that this decree came from the state, that shows that our schools are unskilled and unqualified. Mm. This decree directly affects the protection of artists' wages and rights, damaging their employment rights, wages, interim plans, pension schemes, professional and social values, and of course, their dignity. This degree has brought to the surface a serious problem that exists for years in Greece, in artistic education in Greece. Artistical education in Greece, with small exceptions, belong to the third level of education, but they are not completely equalized to an undergraduate degree. Thus, there is a gray zone forever in which level our diplomas belong to. Since we don't have a bachelor degree, we can't apply for postgraduate studies abroad or universities in general. Although the Greek constitution says that, for example, drama schools belong to the higher education, our diplomas are just a certificate of attendance, more or less, without further value. This gray zone that I refer to above gave in the past years some windows of escape to make long story short, but with this last degree, these all have been abolished. Now artists in Greece are unspecialized workers, high school graduates, stating that the artists don't have value the same as doctors or lawyers or engineer or businessmen in the social chain. Briefly, I'd like to inform you, those of you might not know, those of you might listen, 
that artistical studies belong to one of the most difficult studies. It requires three to four years of everyday compulsory attendance, 12 to eight hours a day with no days off, plus hours for rehearsals every day plus the weekend. Since you need to perform every day, this requires full-time availability of the students and since it's not possible for us to work, work simultaneously, that had an impact on our own money that we make as students. The ones who manage to work simultaneously, they do it at the risk of their own health. Since it's not a university, we don't have the facilities of a university. That is, no feed facilities, um, uh, except from the fact that we pay for our own tuition fees most of the time. For 73 days now, people of the arts in Greece have shown an unprecedented uh, struggle. I'd like to name the list of the occupation buildings below. So, right now, 73 days after the mobilizations in Greece, the National Theater School, the, the National Theater of Greece, the building chile, the National Theater of Greece, the Rex um, building, the Royal Theater, the Apollo Theater of Spatra, Olympia Music Theater, Maria Callas are in occupation. The National Theater Drama School, the National Dance School, the National Theater Drama School of Northern Greece, the Regional Theater of Patra, the Company of Macedonian Studies, the Monila Zarison of Thessaloniki, all artistic high schools, the Fine Arts of Peloponnese, the Fine Arts Factor of Athens, the Theater of Thessaloniki, the Theater of Studies of Patra, and the Musical Education Study of Thessaloniki, all of them are under occupation. Also, recently, the professors of the National Theater Drama School, the National Theater Drama School of Northern Greece, the National Theater, the, the Regional Theater, and the Theater Drama School of Arts, Theater Technics, have resigned from their duties. The list is growing every day. Among the concerts, the movie projections, the marches, the protests, the strikes, the negotiations with the prime minister, the ministers, the building as a, um, occupation, the interventions in theater uh, performances, there are also some highlights abroad. For example, Le Coq uh, Drama School of uh, France shared a video and text supporting Greece. Schaubühne mm -hmm. um, director Thomas Ostermeyer also. Did Theater Berlin uh, also made an intervention at uh, Abhoite High School Sara? Um, and many, many other um, institutions in between Berlin and abroad have made this uh, support. Theater and artistic education is certain as its birthplace. Greece is using its culture to bring cal tourists, and we, that we are not tourists, will leave the country. Today, I see familiar faces around and I know that we share the same story. Still, still, uh, Greece still exists all the other months of the year. It's not <laughs> only for the summer. <laughs> Greece leaves <laughs> its children strained, its artists unskilled, unpaid, easy to be manipulated, urged to work black money without the possibility of postgraduate degrees. Culture in Greece doesn't matter, it's a hobby. 
and it serves certain purposes. We, Greek artists, in Greece or abroad, we call you for solidarity to our fight. We need your support by all means to stop killing culture in Greece. Support us, spread the word, sign the petition that there is online. You can find it by against any kind of degradation of art institutions in Greece. Thank you very much for being here and hearing us.